We cannot allow that. We cannot allow you to bring down churches. We cannot allow you. We cannot allow that. Welcome back to AFAX number one stop to entertainment and trending news. Machakos Governor Wavinya Ndeti has tearfully castigated President William Ruto for allegedly sending machines to demolish houses in parts of the county. Wavinya Ndeti said they could not allow demolitions to go on without any notice to residents of houses and owners of other properties. The governor complained that the destruction of property continued behind high-level discussions between her and the president. She also shared this together with her speech. It's shocking that government security agencies proceeded with the demolitions of homes without issuing any notice to the affected people as the law requires. It is partially disappointing that the process was unnecessarily rushed despite the fact that there were ongoing high-level discussions between the president and I on the matter. Let's have a look as to what she had to say. Why is it that you're doing that to us? Kama di kwa kwa mashimu waruto wewe unge kubali yo ifanyike? We cannot allow that. We cannot allow you to bring down churches. We cannot allow you. We cannot allow that. I want to tell His Excellency, you are talking about bottoms up. You talked about taking care of these people who are down here. What is happening now that the same people are the how what to the same same people ndio unawaumiza? Why are you doing that? Mimi niliongea na wewe leo asubuhi na ukaniambia vizuri utaangalia tukiendelea kuongea hivi watu wetu wamefukuzwa makanisa tano yameangushwa shule tatu zimeangushwa el nino ndio hiyo mtiani ndio hiyo ina why is it that you're doing that to us kama ni kwako mheshimiwa wa Ruto wewe ungekubali hiyo ifanyike We cannot allow that. Now you have seen Wavinyandeti getting emotional there. Since Friday, around 50 houses, including churches and mosques, were bulldozed in Athi River in response to Machako's High Court ruling that deemed the occupation of the land illegal. Residents on the disputed East Africa Portland cement land in Athi River asked the government to intervene and overturn the eviction decision. East Africa Portland cement won a judicial battle to remove squatters from 1,740 hectares of land in Machakos County after claimants failed to present paperwork proving ownership. Some evictees have lived on the disputed land for over 10 years. Other people are also pleading with President William Ruto to intervene and protect them from the disaster that has rendered them homeless. You are up to date. Thanks so much for watching. Subscribe and hit that notification bell so you'll be the first to be notified once we have any new uploads. I will catch you on the next one. Bye-bye.